Well, hello everybody. How's everybody doing? <sighs> yeah, it's been a minute. Uh, it's uh, it's pretty humid out here today. <laughs> I just got dressed and uh, come out here with the white spotted dog and I have to get that thing moved because I I was lazy this week and uh, I left it sitting outside and we've had some rain and I need to power wash the uh, mower deck off What are you doing? Huh? And I got some flowers out here too that I need to plant. But I gotta see if I can unlock my door. Is it unlocked? Oh, my door is actually unlocked. You believe that? Yeah. So how is everybody doing? I uh, went over to the Harley dealer this week uh, in fact, it was yesterday. I actually went over there twice. Uh, I would like to go back over there today because I am thinking about getting a full face helmet. I do have a full face helmet, and I'll show it to you. I can, yeah, I can hold it up. And here it is. It's it's very outdated, but it does the job. And as some of you might know, that uh, April 14th, I laid my bike over and I didn't even have my half lid on. I laid it over right here in front of the house, broke both wrists. I'll try to pin a couple of videos up here on the top. Let's get a bottle of water out here. Now, last couple of weeks, I have been able to start using my wrist, my hands, and it feels great, let me tell you. So, figured I'd uh, hang out with you for a few minutes, and I appreciate if you'd hit the thumbs up, hit subscribe if you're not subscribed. Uh, this is not usually my usual content, um, but it is what it is. I posted a short yesterday. You can go look at my shorts. Well, not the kind of shorts you wear, but my sh a short video. <laughs> uh, when I went over to the Harley dealer and looked at the bike, and it is getting back together. Uh, for those of you that don't know this motorcycle that you see here, this is not mine. It is a friend of mine's. But I do have... Uh, a pull behind camper trailer uh, that I pull behind my Harley Davidson Road Glide Limited. So, yeah. Anyway, enough of that. I'm going to get the mower moved and uh, I'm going to power wash the deck, clean off all the grass because I left it sitting out and it has rained a couple times this week. And I don't want the, the mower deck to get rusted out. So hopefully I get it moved, get the power washer out here and get it, get it cleaned off. And then maybe by that time the grass might be a little bit drier and uh, we can get busy cutting some grass. First thing I need to do is get my safety glasses out of the truck. I left them in here yesterday. And uh, throw them on. It's not really about the, I guess it is about the safety aspect of it, but part of it is the, uh, uh, they're shaded, they're tinted, and they don't cost me an arm and a leg. I think they're like five bucks at Walmart. So, This is pretty much going to be another test 
on my wrist as far as my strength goes. I'm gonna go in here and get the key to the mower. And it's gonna be a test for the spotted dog here because he likes to uh, get all wound up when I start the mower up. My seat's all wet. I'm gonna have to go in and get a towel, wipe that off because nobody likes a wet tail end, right? Yeah. Well, here we go. A lot of dirt and grass underneath there. Come on, baby. A lot of dirt, grass, and all kinds of stuff, but I just wanted to spray it off here real quick. At least get some of it off the deck. So I'm not catching anything on fire on the more top of the mower deck, right? Yeah, lots of grass. I need to start. Well, I'm gonna keep at it here, and uh, when I uh, get done here, I'll be back with you here. Well, everybody, I got most of the grass off the mower deck, and there's uh, there it is right there. But yeah, there's covers on that mower on where the pulleys are at that. I need to really take off, take those off, and uh, uh, really clean out from underneath those. But uh, a couple of weeks ago, we planted some tomato plants, and I don't know if they got too much rain or too much sun, but they're they're hanging in there is what I want to tell you. So. Yeah, here they are. I'll show them to you here. See how kind of a brownish they are right there on the leaves? But this one over here, it seems to be growing. And it's got a couple more buds on it, so that's good. Let me go back over here. Here you go. That one's, <laughs> that one's not doing so hot. The pepper plants are hanging in there too. So I don't know if there's bugs on them or getting them bottom leaves or what's going on, but I don't know. I would say, I'll go over here and look at the rain gauge and see how much water's in it. I didn't look at it when we got the rain. I think it was uh, night before last we had pretty good rain showers come through. Uh, it's so, yeah, it's, 
it's got almost an inch and a half in there so that was probably from the week and uh, yeah so I'm gonna get busy I'm gonna start going ahead and start mowing and uh, see what I can get done the ground and grass is still a little bit wet but by the time I get about halfway done it'll probably be dried off so and uh, that way I can go in and clean up and Miss Linda's at the store and uh, yeah so we'll talk to you here a little bit and I hope you all are having a safe day and uh, we'll check in with you here in a little bit well everybody I made a couple of uh, rounds in the yard and uh, yeah <laughs> that's not a snake that is actually the mower belt and uh This is going to be a nightmare for me with my wrists the way they are to get the mower deck out, get the deck, get the, uh, try and find me a new belt. That's water. Look. Yeah? Where are we going to put that? It's for your channel. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Hmm. What happened? Belt broke. Like a small rubber. Yeah. Burning rubber. Yep. Belt broke. Uh-oh. So I guess I'll uh, work on getting this mower deck out. I guess we're going to end up power washing the whole thing off anyway. Well, everybody, it's now like 4 o'clock, 4.30 in the afternoon. And... Well, I went down to the town and bought a new belt. $68 for a mower deck belt. So, I guess uh, <laughs> I got back from the store and it was like cooking. Mother Nature is cooking today. So I went in the house, sat down in the chair, took a little snooze, watched a little of the YouTubes, and uh, we'll try and get this belt on, so. There we go. Now, explain something to me. They got one of these things on here. It's a plastic deal. It says, let's see if I can read it. It says cut to remove. Okay. Looks like I gotta take a little knife and, and cut this here. Let's see if I got one. Oh, look at there. That wasn't so bad. All right. Well, there's the belt. I've got to take this other cover off on the other side. My gosh, we got it. 
Now look at this. Look at all that. That's a lot of grass. Ooh. That didn't feel good. That was a splinter. <sighs> all right. Now, the other side has the diagram, but I think I'm going to clean the mower deck off here real quick. All right, well, we got the belt on. It was a lot easier than what I thought. As I can remember back in the day, on the older mower, mowers, you had to take the mower deck almost completely off the mower to get the, mower, the belt on. So I'm not gonna put those covers back on right yet. I'm just gonna run it. That way I can clean it and grease it when I'm all done and uh, there's a there's a pretty good breeze blowing uh, this afternoon so hopefully it won't be as hot so <clears throat> hope y'all are having a good day well everybody I got the I got the grass mode and uh, I need to mix up I need to mix up some bunch of uh, weed spray, but uh, we're not going to do that today. Uh, I'm going to go in and cool off a little bit, relax, and then I'm going to come out and spray off the mower deck again, grease everything up. But here, I want you to see the, I want you to see the what we got over here. Yeah, I've had that rose bush there for a while. Uh, I've got a brand new flag in the house, and I might change it out today. Take the old one down. I got a bunch of uh, little uh, weeds and trees and stuff in this little dog pen fence row, but, and a little bit of trimming to do. So I'm not going to do all that today, maybe sometime uh, during the week. I have not carried a weed eater around and uh, don't plan to for a while. I don't know, maybe next week I'll fire it up and get out here and, and do some weed eating. And uh, so, well, I hope you all are having a good day. And I'm going to go in and get something to eat, relax a little bit, and uh, thank you for your support, and hopefully, hopefully, uh, hopefully I might be getting the bike back this week, and uh, keep on the lookout for a uh, video uh, this week for the Great American Convoy with Adam Sandoval. Uh, he'll be coming to town this week, so. Well, y'all stay out of trouble and uh, we'll see you on the next one, okay? Say hi to a stranger and thank a veteran, y'all. Have a good, have a good night. It's overwhelming. I know it does me. It's kind of nice to not have on. He doesn't know what the camera is. <laughs> He's curious, but he'll get familiar with it. Try oh, to yeah. It. Here he comes. Yeah. Come on. Come on.
Gimme, gimme. What's your name? Captain Morgan? <laughs>